Hi everyone, it's Sarah from Amy Rose Studio here and I thought I would just hop on to show you a really cool tip in Canva. Say you've created a design in Canva and you want the colours to match your brand. Now I know a really cool way to do this. So what we want to do is we want to create a new page and I'll just choose this one here. And if we go to Elements and if we go down to just let it load, we want to find a grid. Okay. So if your brand has five colors, you would choose a grid with five in. If your brand has four colors, you would choose a one with four and so on. But mine has five, so I'm going to choose this one here. I want to click on the first one, column. And I've got my brand kit already stored in Canva here. So I'm going to go along and change each one to the colours of my brand. Like that. All right. And now we can just download this. And I'll call that brand colours. And then once that's downloaded, find it there and we can just upload it. Now we go back to our original design here that we want to change. And we go to our uploads and we select that one that we've just uploaded. Now you can just make that a bit smaller and put in the side there. And then you want to right click and at the bottom it says apply colors to page. So when you press that, it is going to change your design to the colors in your brand colors. If you're not happy with the first one, you can again do it. You can do this as many times as you like until you get the colors you're looking for. If you wanted specific parts of it changed, you can just go ahead and change that individually just to perfect it how you want it. Okay. And so on like that. Okay. Now, if you wanted a different color palette, you can go ahead to Google and you can type in, say you wanted a summer color palette. Just click on that. Go through Google Images and find a palette that you like. There's a nice tropical summer one. So just copy image. Go back into Canva and paste that in there. And then do the same again. Apply colors to page. And there we go. You can change it to any colors you like, any color palette. It just saves loads of time when you're creating a design. Instead of going through all the individual elements and changing them one by one. But what I must say is this will only happen with colors that can be changed in Canva. So photographs wouldn't work. When you click on an element and the colors are able to be changed here, that's what can be changed. So if you chose a photo, say um, a photo of, a, so say you had a rainbow and it wasn't an SVG, it was just a, a photo or a graphic that can't be changed. So for example, this one here, now this one here, because it says edit photo up there, it means it's not an SVG. The cut, the the colors couldn't be changed. So if we went in our uploads and uploaded our brand colors there, just to show you, apply colors to page, everything's going to change except this image, because again, it's not an SVG and the colors can't be changed. 
But I hope this has helped you and it's going to save you a little bit of time when you're creating your designs. If you found this video helpful, you can give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video.